Hey, please excuse me if I make a wild guess. Right now, you're sitting here on YouTube wasting time. Meanwhile, you're wasting a lot of money without knowing it. Here's some background. So I was checking my online statements recently and I was noticing, wait, what is that? Yeah, that. They charge you every month in your account for something called insurance, which I never used. I mean, sure I had bills to pay, uh, but they were all for stuff that I used, like my house or my phone or my internet. But this insurance thing, I didn't actually use it. So why did I pay for it? And after I did some research, I realized that what was happening was that all this insurance money was going to rich guys who were spending it on their fancy homes, fancy boats, and other rich guy stuff that they used to show off to their friends. So I got pissed, and I made this website called buzzquote.me. Now, first of all, I need to tell you that you can get a buzz quote yourself to save a pile of money by going right now to buzzquote.me. Here's some more detail. This is what happened when I put BuzzQuote on YouTube. I got millions of views. I got tens of thousands of comments. People were interested. People made fun of my lisp. But the story that I told just made sense. It's reasonable, and it's the story I'm going to tell you right now. But first, you need to know that one, getting a BuzzQuote is free. And two, if you don't get a buzz quote, it's very likely you're going to overpay. Here's a quick test to see if you are overpaying currently. Number one, did you get your insurance directly from a well-known company? This is pretty simple. If you call one company, they're going to give you whatever rate they want to. No competition, pretty obvious. Number two, has it been six months or more since your last auto insurance quote? If it has, you're missing out. Auto insurance rates change monthly. It's quite possible that yours should have gone down. But the way that the big insurance companies make money is that they tend to forget to inform you of a rate decrease and keep you at the older, higher rate for as long as they can get away with it. It's sketchy, but that's the way the business works. Number three, has it been six months or more since you've been in a serious accident? If it has, you should be rewarded with a lower premium. It's that simple. If you answered yes to any of these questions, that means you need to go right now to buzzquote.me to save a big pile of money on your insurance. And one more thing, have you seen any ads recently for insurance companies on TV? Yeah? Do you know how much these ads cost? About $5.9 billion per year. Do you know how much money that is? Now, guess who is paying for all that advertising? You are. That money is paid for out of everyone's auto insurance premiums. These companies are not stupid, but they think that you are. They think they can get away with spending billions on advertising and jacking up premiums to pay for it. But you're not stupid. That's why you're going to go right now to buzzquote.me to save money and show the big insurance companies where they can shove it. Okay, so here's the full story. You see, the reason you overpay currently is that your insurance rates are controlled in your state capital. You're required by law to carry insurance, but your state only allows a few well-connected big insurance companies to give you quotes. Every year, lobbyists for these big insurance companies put on lots of expensive parties, and every year the same big insurance companies write big checks to your state politicians. With this money, your politicians put ads on TV so they get re-elected, and in return, the politicians allow the insurance companies to raise their rates every year. The politicians stay in office, the insurance companies stay rich, and you keep overpaying. So, here's your solution. Buzzquote.me. With Buzzquote.me, you break the cycle. You submit your info directly to any company that comes to the table, and all at once, the insurance carriers have to compete for your business. Here's some more detail. Maybe you've seen an ad on TV for a famous insurance company. We can't mention their names here for legal reasons, but it's important that you know that if you go for a direct quote from a nationally advertised insurance brand, in the end, you will lose. Without competition, insurance companies have the power to charge you whatever they want. To fix this, you need to go right now to buzzquote.me to get a real competitive quote. So, do you know how insurance companies set your rates? They use data like your zip code, 
credit score and your years of driving experience to try to price your risk as a driver. This often ends up being totally unfair because even if you are a safe driver, you're often forced to pay really high rates because of factors out of your control. And here's what's incredible. The insurance companies could fix this if they wanted to by simply allowing drivers to use a smartphone app which would record speeding and other erratic driving behavior, report this data back and use it to give high rates to the bad drivers and low rates to the good drivers like you. This would be a fair and equitable way to price car insurance. The insurance companies could do this, but they don't. Why not? Because then they would have to lower rates for the good drivers. Bad for business. And as we've seen, although the insurance companies are regulated by state governments, and nobody in state government is interested in this either, they're mostly interested in those big campaign contributions rolling in from the insurance companies. The conspiracy is real. Don't be fooled by fancy advertisements and branding. Get a real competitive quote. Go to buzzquote.me right now.